Hi everyone. So I'm here at my parents' place and uh, this custard apple tree was the very few first video that I've made on the channel. Um, just to share how, well, how I grow the custard apple tree. Um, like I said, this tree has been here for, I don't know, many, many years now. And this here, I did say that um, it's less prone to infestation, but now I'm starting to realize that they are um, getting a bit of these white moth thing. It doesn't really affect the fruit. Um, it just looks a bit not very nice. So if you look at that fruit over there as well, um, it's starting to have it also. Like I said, it does not affect how the fruit tastes, um, but uh, it will not make it look so pretty. So this over here, you can see um, there are lots of custard apple on this tree and there's some really big ones. I don't know if you can, if you come over this way. Like there's one right here in front of our face. This one right here. That's huge. It's probably ready to pick. And if you can see through there, just straight ahead, it's a massive one in there. Oh yeah, there you go. And if you follow upwards and then going up that direction and all the way up there, there's a massive one up there as well. It's like all the way around up high. Yeah. Look at this. Crazy amount. So, um, yeah, I do, I mean, they don't, uh, I don't live at this house, so I don't come here as often, um, but every now and then I like to come out here and check it out because it's pretty amazing. Now I only have one other, no, two other trees up on the land that are from this uh, variety. Like I said, it's been many, many years, I don't know this variety anymore. My assumption is um, Tropic Sun or maybe African Pry. Those are the only two because I don't think this is the uh, Praxton Prolific variety. Um, but by far, this tree has the most tastiest and yummiest fruit out of all the trees that I have growing currently. So um, this year I'm going to make it a point when I do eat the ripe one, I'll save the seed and I'll try and learn how to graft it from the branch to a seedling. I've been trying to do that but then somehow I got distracted so I never really follow through but maybe you know it's about time. So yeah just really really higher up you see some massive one and look at this direction come this way if you look up this direction yeah can you see some really huge one on that direction there with my finger point and also <laughs> up there can you see it no come this way see up there look at all of those ones higher up massive one like here you can see there one there Yeah, just behind the right there, we see the big one. Crazy. Yeah. Okay. What do I do with these? Usually we offer it to the Buddha <laughs> in the spirit world, uh, giving thanks and then maybe we eat some. Um, <laughs> all right. I'll catch you next time. Bye.